is Keely from Mini Metal Gods here with Dear Superstar. So, how did your band meet? Um, well, we've known each other for like all our lives, pretty much. Uh, we've been in a band before, um, so, like, since 1997. We've been slugging this kind of thing. Um, so yeah, we've known each other like pretty much all our lives. So yeah, we're all like lifelong friends. Um, do you have any other jobs off stage? Um, not really. Our, our, um, our drummer is a tattooist, uh, which comes in really handy, obviously. Um, free tattoos on the road is always cool. Um, and um, yeah, I, I used to do graphical design, so. Like, all the, all the uh, t-shirt designs and the MySpace designs, all that, I kind of do all that. Um, but other than that, you know, um, we kept so busy on the road all the time, we don't really get a chance to um, earn some proper money, unfortunately. <laughs> Which is why we're so poor and have to wear, like, homemade clothing. Um, if you could be an animal, what would you be? Um, I'd be a giraffe, because I think a long neck would be really handy. <laughs> <laughs> and also, I don't know, they just intrigue me. It's like, how can something have a longer neck than its body? You know, it's, I think it's a cool thing to be a giraffe. I'd like to be spotty as well. Um, what's the worst job you've ever had? Um, I used to work in this like warehouse, moving trainers around and shoes, and um, the my boss was a, a right willy. <laughs> <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, you know, it's like I, I hate that job. The guy treated me like who? And uh, yeah, it was rubbish. Uh, what about you, Stewie? My worst ever job. I used to clean the legs on snooker tables at a snooker club. Really? Yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> that oh, terrible. I thought but that, that first job that I had, he made me sleep the whole, sweep the whole warehouse with a handbrush, <clears throat> which uh, sucked a lot. So, um, if you had a million pounds, what would you spend it on? Um, Guitar-shaped swimming pools and drugs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and a Rolls Royce. That's it. I think I'd spend up on that. So, what bands do you admire? Oh, you know what? All the bands that are on Sonosphere right now, it's like, just, they're amazing. So, you know, Metallica are obviously a huge influence. Um, Def Leppard got me into rock and roll. Um, but then, you know, bands like Papa Roach we've been touring with and uh, Book Cherry as well. Uh, you know, all these, like, new bands and old bands, just pretty much anyone who plays rock and roll inspires us. So, But also life, you know, life inspires us. So, so what are you going to do after you've toured at Sonosphere? Um, we're going to take a bit of time off, we're going to record some new tracks um, and then back on the road, you know, Dear Superstar is built for the road and that's all we want to do, so yeah, we're going to stay touring and touring and touring until, I don't know, we either die or, or get, get forced into a studio to record a new album. And finally, are you enjoying Sonosphere? How about you, Stu, the son of Dear Superstar? What? Are you enjoying Sonosphere? I am having a nice time. It's, it's brilliant, the atmosphere is wicked, there's some cool bands, so hopefully catch some of those later. And it's gonna get messy. It's our bass player's birthday today, so. Yeah, Amadeus and Dear Superstar, it's his birthday today, so um, luckily I haven't had to put any money in the swear box, so we can buy him some more drinks. And um, yeah, it's good, you know, we've, I've got, got a lot of friends here, so it's cool to kick back and have a party with them. And yeah, it's great weather as well, so who can complain? Thank you. Thank you.